Oh yeah. Oh good. So oh where's oh I thought he had um those um rockets. Okay. That's cool. No problem. I'll, oh shit. Yo guys, what is up? Fly here. Welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we're gonna be playing with my favorite second derp in the game. This is behind the whole row, but this is a Type 97 Chiha short gun, which is a 120 millimeter naval gun put onto a tank. Now, it's not as cool as the 130 mil on the SU-100Y, but at the BR that we're at, this gun gets the job done. Now, the only round that we have to use is 30, or excuse me, is high explosive that has 30 millimeters of penetration. Now at 2.0, that's certainly enough to take out most of the tanks. However, there are some tanks and higher BR tanks that will verse where we'll have to use different means. One of the means that I like to try out is to shoot an HE round near their gun or trap shot to allow the explosive to go down on the soft top portion of the tank, take out its gun, and then maybe shoot underneath the tank to where the high explosive force will bust through the uh, bottom of the tank's armor into the tank, killing it. Trap shots and underneath shots are some of my favorite way to kill tanks in the game. It just makes you feel like a badass. Oh, and request series is a go again. This is gonna be my last tank that I play with my choosing from the new patch. You guys let me know in the comments below what uh, new tanks or what old tanks we should take out for our playing and viewing pleasure. All right, guys, without further ado, let's get into it. What a fan flippin' tastic map for the Chiha. How I like to play this tank is up close and personal. Now, we have a big gun, and yes, we have high explosive that does the same amount of damage anywhere uh, or at any range you shoot it from. But the problem with this big gun that, you know, won't be a problem soon is that I'm still trying to learn the arcs and the velocity and the trajectory of... Did I just say the same thing three times in a row? The closer you are when you first get it or you first start playing, the better you are. And that reload rate will back you up. So I'm going to be following this Panzer IV into the mix here. We're going to be pushing towards their spawn, but not spawn camping. I'm going to be taking a left on the road uh, at H2, I believe. Yeah, this guy's perfectly the same idea as me. So as you can see, they've already captured the base, and there's already a lot of enemy players over there. Um, and it kind of sucks that we're not over there right now, but I'm just trying to secure our flank by killing any any enemy players that want to flank us. And then we'll have the opportunity to hit their rear and hopefully kill them all. It's not instant gratification, if you will. But a lot of good things in video games require time. I just want to state for the record right now, this team is so dead. So dead. Nobody flanked at all. I got an enemy tank in front of me. I just saw him moving right to left. Trying to spot him out here. Okay, we're going to stop here and wait for him to poke out. Poor shot on my part. Poor shot. He has no idea where that came from. Now, this guy has too much armor. Let's see what we can do here. Let's try to shoot underneath his tank. A little bit lower. We needed to drop right below his bottom of his tank. Too low. Okay, he doesn't see me, and he has bad turret rotation. We're gonna get, oh shit, he moved again. Took out his track one more time. This is a hard guy to go up against with 120 millimeter. Still, he still doesn't know where he's being shot from. There we go, okay. Tang, oh shit. Come on, reload, reload. This guy's so dangerous, too. Fuck. God, I thought we were reversing like some easy anti-air and American tanks over here. We have some of the hardest tanks to kill from the 120 millimeter. We're gonna try to flank this guy, go behind him and get that underneath shot. Captured his own. The wheels are 
Here he is. Here he is. Now look, side shotting doesn't work on this guy. Just kidding, it does. All right, good, good. Maybe, maybe it's the T60 that I have trouble with. All right, two kills down. I saw an anti-air over here to our right. Ooh, shit, far range. Whoa, whoa, where did he go? I just saw him. Did he, he disappear? Enemy tech chart. Fucked. A little late on the shot right there. He's burning up. I think our Panzer IV is having some trouble. I'm going to go up there and help him. And hopefully that... Okay, we're going to wait here and chill, actually. Oh, fuck. Okay, that Tetrarch's going to be up in probably about um, 20 or 10 seconds. This guy is fucking kicking ass. Okay, Tetrarch's dead. The Panzer IV is safe. Now it's pretty much cleanup time. We have a nice hold on A. We're going to post up to defend any new spawns coming into the battle. I'm going to get right behind this mound in front of us. Spotted enemy tank. It looks like a Russian Panzer III. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? There he is, there he is. Come on, get there, get there, get there. Ooh, got a good hit on his side. Getting some cover here. I think he sees me. And the problem is a lot of new tanks are spawning up to our left as well. Ooh, shit. He fired at that Panzer IV. We're going to take advantage of this and go around to his left. Okay, be quiet, be quiet, be quiet. Yes, a hit. Oh, I don't know what to do. I need help. Need help. Maybe we can set him on fire a little bit. Nope, nope, nope. That didn't work. Got his track again. Fuck. Okay, he's up and moving again. Okay, he, he just missed. Move, 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 move. He has bad turret rotation and he's tracked. Come on, come on, we can do this. Don't fail me now. Not enough depression. We're gonna shoot his fucking hell. Come on, come on, turret, rotate, rotate. We need we need negative depression here. Okay, here we go. Got his engine. Got him critical. We're moving, we're moving. We have four more shots left. That T3 just killed that um, plane, by the way. Attention to the map. This guy is one tough cookie to crack. Okay, here we go. Oh, I can't get this guy. Transmission hit. We got two more shots left. We're going to try for two more fires, hopefully. Okay. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hey, team, thanks for the help. That's all I can say. So that should be game. We got two rounds left. We had a little bit of trouble dealing. Oh, shit, they're capturing A. God damn it, I thought this game was about to be over. Oof. Ooh, look at that fucking hurricane. 
I feel like this is going to be my fate as well if I move in there. But I'm going to anyways. We have a backup on this thing. This is way too quiet. Way too quiet. Okay, we're, we're starting to capture A. I'm going to go defensive right behind this tram. I hear a plane incoming. Oh, yeah. Oh, good. So, oh, where's... Oh, I thought he had um those um rockets. Okay. That's cool. No problem. I'll... Oh, shit. Oh, overdrop for sure. Overdrop. Good God. That was a lot of bombs by the... Oh, God. No. Fuck. Little... Here, let's call him out to our team. They'll see him. Use extinguisher. Good camp. Good camp. And there goes that M5A1 that killed us. And that should be game. So a night battle on Korea. Fucking awesome. Now, don't worry. I'll make it a little bit brighter uh, in the editor for you guys. So you don't have to turn up your gamma on your monitor. But last game was a good demonstration of what happens when... You get a little bit up-tiered in the Chiha. It makes killing things a little harder. Actually, a lot harder. Um, looking at that Panzer III, there was nowhere I could pen him. From the side, from the front, from the rear. Well, I didn't really check rear uh, too much. But even underneath, we weren't really able to do too much damage from the front. Now, I think that was because he was on some weird terrain where the game didn't respond well to me shooting high explosive below his hole. That Panzer III, that Russian one, was 2.3 BR. So just a small BR increase of 0.3 makes your killing power much less. Luckily, hopefully, it seems like we're at a lower BR, or at the proper BR 2.0. And we are right around A and B. We're gonna be trying to snipe some people sitting behind and moving to their objectives. Okay, we'll chill out here for a second. So they just started to capture B. I'm going to move over there to see if I can't engage them. I don't see anyone at A, though. So so they must be at C and B. Maybe some stragglers will show up at B. Or A, excuse me. Enemy so spotted. We're going to follow him in. Okay, critical hit. Engine. We're going to shoot for that turret next. Okay, he's dead. Now I what? Oh, he he was able to capture A in that time. Shit. Okay, we're gonna move in there, decap it, but not cap it yet, just so we don't spend that much time. Oop. Let's not go in there. We'll definitely get trapped. Come on, buddy. Let's move. Someone's probably fucking behind us right now. A is now decapped, moving towards B because that's the only base they still have um, a hold on. Ooh, we got a long sniping thing over here. Got some tracer fire. Ooh, wait, I think I... S nah, that's not him. Tango! Okay, got a nice hit on his engine. He's not moving. We're going to shoot for turret next, just like on the LVT. He's like, what the fuck, bro? Why'd you hit me like that? Okay, he's dead. Wow, the explosions at night look flipping awesome. So if you look at the scoreboard right now, or just the... Um oh, I thought we were capturing B. We have a hold... Huh. I don't think anyone's capturing A. Okay, someone's in B again. We're going to try to reset B, then move back to A. Okay, so they just captured A, and they're about to capture B. I'm looking on top of this hill to my right to see if anyone's sitting up there trying to... Uh... Oh, shit. Okay, he's dead. And that should be it here. Okay, we got two teammates here. Going to recapture B. I'm moving my ass back to A. Pretty enjoyable battle so far, especially with a night battle. During night battle, a lot of players play passive just because it's hard to spot and hard to, you know, navigate the map like you would if it was daytime. We're almost by A. Trying to see if I can't see anybody before I get there. We have an, a hog go, I think, going into A right now. So scratch that. A is being captured by our team. Now I think it's, it's it's time to defend. We have pretty much the map advantage now. And the tank advantage. Holy shit. I tell you, the Japanese tanks dominate. Well, I wouldn't say like the Hago and you know those, but like the 
Horo, the Chi Ha 120. These things definitely dominate low, low tier. But once it moves up to like 2.3, no, sir. Now a T26, here we go, we got him. He has no idea we're here. Boop. I think he saw us last second. <laughs> All right, so we got four kills this match. Ooh, they're capturing C. I'll tell you, this low tier is so, is so enjoyable to play. So I'm glad we were able to show you. What the fuck, dude? I'm heading to B right now. I don't know how this guy did that. A fucking snake. Slipped right between me and this Type 94 right here. And I think he's going to get there first. He should be moving forward. I wish I didn't venture too far away from B. Staying frosty as fuck right now. We're entering B. We'll know if he's here or gone by us resetting the cap. Middle looks good. I don't look for any dark Russian tanks. That green blends in. <sighs> Nothing. They've, they captured A. He moved on to A. This fucking guy is a hero. He's definitely going to die at A, though. There's too many fucking players over there. We found him. There he is. So, fellas, I hope you have enjoyed today's video. I'm glad that we were able to showcase two different sides of the table for how the Chiha will work in game. One, you'll really have to work for your kills by dismantling and getting behind and trap shooting or underneath shooting. I don't really know what that's called, but we're gonna coin it that. And then on the other hand, have a game where you can shoot anywhere and pen anywhere and kill them pretty easily. But guys, in the comment section below, let me know what tank, play, whatever you wanna see in the next video, because we're starting back up the request series. Have a great day, guys. Peace out.